Keep your eyes focused on that contact. Don't care about the outcome. Halfway back, commit and expect to get a little punchy divot with it, okay? Your swing's starting to go. You're on the back nine with a good score and you feel like, gosh, I, 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 I'm playing well, but I'm losing it. I don't feel so confident over these closing holes. Get back in with this second swing, right? This is the get me to the clubhouse feeling, except we're gonna play a nine iron swing with your hybrid, just so you can get 150, 160 yards shot out there. And it's helpful for into the wind as well. It's a little bullet. And you've done my nine iron drill, right? Most of you. The nine iron drill is basically that little stance, back to halfway, commit through gets you the feeling of synchronizing your arm swing with your body rotation to help you get the strike back. So start thinking about that action. That's the swing you want, except we're going to do it with our hybrid. Without being negative, if you feel like you're losing the swing, you just got to gear it down. I remember Elazabal winning his second Masters. He wasn't swinging very well on that final day and he was playing three quarter punch shots all the way around to depend on his short game, which was very good to get him the green jacket. It worked brilliantly for him. He didn't risk anything. So here we go. This is how you're gonna play that shot. Get your hybrid, all right? Grip right down, make it like an eight iron length. Stand accordingly as if it's an eight iron. And now start thinking of that half swing where you're only going back to chest high. Move the ball back in your stance a little bit and think of the strike. Start thinking about that strike with the movement you're going to put on it, the blueprint swing you're going to put on it is the nine iron. It's going to look something like this. Halfway, commit and feel like you're finishing short. Keep your eyes focused on that contact. Don't care about the outcome. Halfway back, commit and expect to get a little punchy divot with it, okay? So, setting up. Pick your target. Forget about your target. You've got the blueprint swing. Commit. And that was an absolute beauty. Right the way on, middle of the green. So this way you play a positive shot and commit to it with a swing that's in your capabilities. And suddenly confidence comes back you get to the clubhouse, you post a good score.